Hello everyone, FunshineX here. Welcome back to Starbound Spotlight on Industrialization Part 2. Last time we got done to a lot of stuff done, and uh, we found out there's pretty much just follow the quest line and you'll get everything you need. So, we are on the Macerator quest, macerating our dusty ores down into dust. Alright, <laughs> so let's go ahead and grab some of these. Uh, there we go, 24 of them. What did it want us to do? Da, 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 da. Oh, get some platinum dust. <laughs> That's what it wanted us to do. Okay, so let's get some platinum dust. Any luck with the search thing here? No. Still horrible. Plat. Platinum ore? Yep, I want some platinum ore. There we go. Now I can put this guy in the macerator. So obviously we're not going to be doing this yeah, early in the game. <laughs> Gonna take a little while, but we've got ten platinum ores. Perfect. Accept the reward. Oh dear, we've macerated an uncommon ore. It won't smelt in an iron ore, an iron stone, or iron furnace. Oh no, we need an electric furnace. Okay. So we'll notice if we go to our iron furnace here, try and put this. Platinum dust. Iron dust works no problem, right? Yep. So that's fine. But this platinum dust we just got. Nothing. Okay. So, uh, let's go into the crafting recipe for... Where is it? Uh, oh, it's in this table, huh? <laughs> Silly me. Okay, we need a uh, electric furnace. Where are ya? Electric furnace. Look at all these things we need again. Um, so we can just break our iron furnace to get that one. Uh, low voltage battery, we know how to make those. Chips and gears. So the only thing new is a high temperature plating. Which is pretty easy. Electrum, refined, iron. So it's uh, basically mixed metal ingot. Or, I don't know, it's kind of like that. <laughs> it's just like three plates, or three things combined. So let's get a couple of those. Okay, I think we're ready to make our electric furnace, so we just go ahead and pop out our iron furnace. Whoops, popped it all out. It's alright. There we go, electric furnace. 800 pixels and all that stuff. Cannot smelt dust gems, your car's not okay, it smelts uncommon dust. Okay, so this allows us to do the uncommons. But our equipment rubber comes scarce really quickly. We need something about use what we learned to build an extractor. Ah, okay, sweet. So let's put this electric furnace down. Pretty cool model. And I'm gonna have to put my anvil back on top of that guy. <laughs> I don't know if that's safe. Nice expensive uh, computer equipment. We're putting an anvil on top. Okay, so um, if you remember, we got really horrible rate of return on these uh, uh, rubber plants which I still have super grow on so don't ex expect them to grow this fast <laughs> Stractory takes another uh, battery another two chips a bunch more gears fluid pipes and a basic machine block fluid pipes uh, need wood interesting okay <laughs> Okay guys, we're back. I got some tin and uh, we are ready to go. Let's get this extractor made. Now for the hard bit. What? <laughs> okay. Your ship's engine isn't that strong enough to take you beyond the Alpha Sector. Craft a distress beacon. Okay, so now it's going to back to the regular quest line. Okay. So let's do that. And now, do we have any rubber? Let's go plant some more rubber just to see how this thing works. So we'll take that sticky resin and we'll put it in our extractor. And we'll see how much we get out of it. Sweet! Look at all that rubber. Three per, so much better, much more efficient. 
Okay, well, so now he wants the uh, the first contact quest, the stress beacon. Maybe we can just grab that out of here, I'm hoping. Whoa, that's a lot of S's. There we go. Need a molten core. Let's fight the ship right over here. Really? Alright, the ship is this is gonna be the fastest you're ever gonna see the ship die. If you can even see it. Come on, ship. Oh, gotta use it. Bam. One hit kill. <laughs> Molten Gore wants us to go to the beta sector. Yep. <laughs> there we go. Start with an upgrade kit. Reward. I want some steel bars. Okay. Steel bars done. <laughs> and now we're on to some tier two. We want the compressor. With the steel bars. Build the compressor. Okay. What does this all take? A battery, circuit chips, steel gears, a compressor bit, and a basic machine block. Okay, well, I can get that guy. I can get... Oh, I need steel gears. Steel gears take iron gears to make. Okay, so it's just like build craft to get, I guess. <laughs> oh, mixed metal ingots. Nice. Tin, iron, and bronze. A motherboard. An upgrade table. Cool. Alright, we done? Compressor bits. Whoa, look at all this stuff. Steel bars, iron bars, silver bars, refined iron bars, and pixels. That's not cheap. Two of those you need. Alright, we're making the compressor. Compresses items. Oh, that's great. Advanced alloys and carbon plates. Oh, we might go nuclear. <laughs> Before we end this tutorial, the last thing to make is very complicated and hard. You should work towards the basic power core. We need gems, so go get some amethyst. Okay, well, I doubt I'm going to find those on a tier 1 planet. So, since it made us kill the spaceship, I'm guessing we need to go to tier 2. So, I'm going to go ahead and put this uh, compressor down. If I can find it. And see what kind of recipes we get here. So... The best, I bet we're going to make mixed metal alloys and compress them, and we're going to make some carbon meshes and compress them down there as well. Oh my goodness, all the, the noises. They're awesome. <laughs> uh, but let's get this upgrade table. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's not good. You need that table to craft the table using the table. Ah, no. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, so here's a, a motherboard. I don't think anything we have takes a motherboard yet. Mixed metals. Let's get some bronze bars. How do we get bronze bars? Are they in here? Bronze blend. Tin dust and copper dust. So that's how we're going to get the bronze blend. Mixing together those two dusts. We'll get us the bronze blend. We'll cook that in our electric furnace to get the bronze bars. And that'll let us get the mixed metal ingots. Okay, well I guess I need another another machine and crafting table. Which takes another wooden crafting table. Okay, wooden crafting table, machinery crafting table, upgrade table. Sweet. So not only we can build these machines, but we can now upgrade them to make them even better. Can we put it right on top? Oh, sweet! <laughs> a desk on a desk. So, look what we got. Resource grades. Adding this to some machines will allow it to process rare resources. Okay. Uh, a resource macerator. So now it can crush rare ores. So basically this will allow us to like, this was for like your extractor and your compressor to do rare stuff. This will be for your uh, macerator so it can macerate rare stuff. And your furnace so you can cook rare stuff. <laughs> um, 
Okay, and we've got upgrades. We've got a hybrid macerator. Oh, resource and the booster upgrades. Cool. Hybrid electric furnace. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> Medium voltage batteries, motherboards, booster upgrades. Booster macerator, boosted electricity, yeah, wow, boosted compressor. So, yeah, that's basically how we're going to get the, the faster macerator and um, allow it to do rare stuff. Not cheap at all, this is definitely moving into the end game. Um, what we're going to learn next is uh, metal, um, bio genetics basically you're gonna turn you're gonna make plants that make ores for you which is really cool they grow super slow uh, slower than even the um, sticky resin so you're gonna be waiting a while but um, you can harvest ore from your plants and it's just kind of the same kind of thing you um, you you buy seeds or you craft these seeds different colors and then you're gonna mix them um, 15 seeds makes a tin seed. I think it's like 20 to copper, or no, I don't know, copper, iron, so forth. So you can get all these, uh, the rare or the common ores based from plants now. Um, you're then going to make a recycler, and uh, that gets rid of all of your extra dirt, your cobble, all that extra crap that you gain, right? You put it in there, um, you need a hundred of the same type of items, so you're not just going to put all your junk decoration blocks in there unless you have a hundred of them, right? Um, and it's going to create one metal, mineral scrap. And we're going to just go and hold on to those yet. He hasn't added that yet to the game, what those are going to be for. But I'm guessing you, you matter. What else could it be for? I don't know. <laughs> um, then what we're going to do next is have this molten glass factory, which is really cool. Uh, let's get off of this menu here. Um, that's going to allow us to make uh, colored jars and then put, uh, or jars, glass jars, and we're going to put the metal, uh, or the plants in them that we get. So you find those like uh, um, petals that you get, they're different colors, and they usually use for dyes. But it's going to allow us to craft stim packs, which is pretty cool. Stim packs are pretty rare in the game, so to be able to craft them is awesome. And that's it for tier two. Uh, once we kill the, the tier two boss, uh, the big robot guy, we'll be able to go to tier three and. Uh, it's going to go to the smelting factory. This upgrade to our iron furnace, and it crafts 10 ores at a time uh, into bars. So that's super fast. Um, it can also um, make a lot more coal. I think it's 8 to 1, or 8 wood to 1 coal instead of 9 to 1 in the other thing, whatever. Uh, and then we're going to get the purification chamber. Um, it's like it's upgrade to our macerator, um, but you get uh, you grind down your ores, you get dirty ores, and then you have to purify them um, into normal dust, which you can then smelt into bars just like we do. And then we'll upgrade our uh, furnace to a coal, a blast furnace, which is going to burn coal coke. Um, we're going to smelt iron. Yeah, nice. So if you smelt iron in a blast furnace, you get steel. So no more using coal to get steel. And uh, same thing with um, titanium into durasteel. No no coal requirement in a blast furnace. So that really helps. I know, end game, you don't want to really collect coal anymore. You're like, why do I need coal? Why am I cutting down trees for charcoal? It's just, you know, silly. So with a blast furnace, that kind of takes that away. And then, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, he's still working on Tier 4 and 5. And uh, that's about all I can progress uh, through the mod easily and show you guys. But, you know, from here, you've seen pretty much everything this mod has to offer. Other than just kind of, like, upgrading the, the different parts um, into better things that can process faster or more items or more efficiently and that kind of thing. So, you're tripling your rub rubber, you're tripling your ores, you're uh, getting steel without using coal um, what's some other benefits of this mod um, well we're gonna get a bunch of gems and I really haven't shown you the gem stuff yet but um, I believe it's used to craft armor which is a pretty nice looking set and uh, yeah that's pretty much it guys so 
I think I'm going to end it there. Um, I don't want to give all of the end game away. I just want to make sure you guys are able to get into the the early game here. And you know what's really cool and what makes this mod one of the most top rated and top downloaded mods on the forums right now is that it's completely uh, idiot proof with the quest system. You know, you just go through and you follow the quests, and it teaches you exactly how to get through at least all of tier one and part of tier two. So, uh, tats off to the creator for that. Um, but yeah, again, this is called uh, Industrialization. It's made by Dralisad. It's on the forums. Pretty much just sort by top downloads or top rated, and you'll find it. And again, the forums are community.playstarbound.com, or you can just go to playstarbound.com to download the game or to buy the game if you haven't bought it already. Why haven't you bought it? This game is awesome, guys. So that's it for uh, this spotlight. Uh, as always, go ahead and go in the comments and tell me which um, spotlight you'd like to, um, or which mod you'd like me to spotlight next. Um, I have a couple in mind. Um, I'll give you a hint. No, I won't give you a hint. <laughs> I was gonna sing. <laughs> yeah, what am I talking about? There's no, I'm not singing. Okay. Uh, anyway, um, I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed this spotlight on industrialization. Bye.